6.7 is here. The only feature we've added to 6.7 is Amelia pop-up. What makes it different from the previous pop-ups that you were able to use with Amelia is that this is our pop-up. So you do not need Elementor Pro anymore. All you need to do is add a button to the page, add its ID, then add the Amelia's booking form and load the booking form manually by adding the ID and choosing the trigger type to be ID. When you click on the pop-up, the form that you selected comes up. Please note that this only works for the new forms, so the old forms will not work in the new pop-up. Now, since we've covered the only feature that we've added, we should take a look at the other improvements. For example, when you have custom duration, which costs zero dollars or zero euros or whatever your currency is, that price is no longer shown in the drop-down here, so it causes less confusion for your customers. Also, one additional improvement is in your employee special days. They used to be sorted by the order in which you created them, but now they are sorted in ascending fashion. So April, October, December, and so on. Last but not least, for all developer license users, we've added API endpoints so that you can hook into Amelia and create your own application if you need to access the data services or other functionality provided by Amelia. Please note that this is included only in Amelia's developer license, while webhooks are available in all license plans, and you can take a look at them in our documentation under for developers webhooks. Please stay tuned for more updates from Amelia because our next one is gonna be a major one.